Hey, welcome to the Duranify channel. As usual, please comment, like, subscribe, and don't forget to share. Give me some love back, guys. It takes a lot of time to make these videos. I appreciate you giving me some feedback. This place is so beautiful, so nice. This is St. Andrews State Park, as you read earlier in the intro, and the water's so clear, beautiful. You can see all of it at the bottom. I'm fly uh, flying my Air 2S with a Freewell CPL filter. You can see this bird taking off here with, with a pelican, and uh, one of these dolphins went after it, and it had to fly away, but yeah, this video is about this dolphins. Are they mating or are they playing? Are they doing the hokey pokey or hanky panky? Not sure. Yeah, check out that gown's paddleboard, man. Very good paddleboarder. And then you see the big shadow underneath. Is it a shark or is it a dolphin? Obviously, sharks wouldn't be here because the dolphins would take care of that problem. But man, yeah, look at these guys. These three guys are just having a blast. Amazing to me how, how they just love horsing around or dolphin around, right? Or roll on top of each other and poke each other. Oh, we got a little toy to play with. A spotted gar. Yeah. <laughs> one of them really wants to get to it and the other ones are bugging him. Just amazing. Just playing around having a good time. Do you notice that there's a couple bigger dolphins here and I suspect those are the parents or the chaperones trying to keep track of these juveniles having a blast. Swim fishy swim. There's no way they can outrun this guy. They could have that fish anytime they want. They're just playing. Or are they doing the hokey pokey or hey, hanky panky? I don't know. Yeah, these are the two bigger fish, or should I would say dolphins, that are chaperoning. Yeah, check out this water and all this wildlife. It's everywhere. <laughs> yeah, classic drone shots are always so impressive of beautiful things to look at, like this swampy island. Alligator pond, they call it. And Army Corps of Engineers put these riprap in there to prevent the soil or the sand from being washed away. And it creates this beautiful pattern. This is actually the bay or the water coming into the sea, the gulf. This is the state park. And all the people suddenly, and I'm one of them down there. And you can see all the grass on is due to a lot of rain. Here they go at it again. I'm trying to figure out if they're playing around or are they getting ready to mate. I'm not sure, but I think they're playing. You guys could definitely drop me a comment. Let me know what your thoughts are. Hanky panky or hoagie pokey? Oh my gosh, look at him. It's so neat. It's kind of like watching your children play. If they're children of the earth, just enjoying themselves. You see tons of fish here. Tons of fish. All sorts of fish. It was a very challenging shoot or flight because of the fact that it was so sunny and I literally had my head covered up by a towel and my controller was under the towel so I can get a clear view of these guys so I could track them. I 
get tons of fish and then you see this paddle surfer actually waiting on the wave and she spots the the dolphins swim by and she starts tapping on the water to attract them and see if they're gonna come over and hang out. But they're not interested. They're just horsing around or shall we say dolphin around. Doing a really good job at it. Look at them. Paddle board wants to get a closer look. And they don't seem to care. They really don't. There's one that's gonna check it out. Said, ah, that's not something I want to mess with, so it swims away from the paddle board. But again, very challenging shoot. The reflection was tremendous. Luckily, I had a CPL filter from Freewell on the, on the camera, and that made it so much easier. Is that a shark underneath there? Oh, you never know. No, I think that's one of the rest course. They're chaperoned. Check this thing out. It's got a 10 ton crane on it. I looked it up by the numbers. Amazing workhorse here. Intercontinental, probably wire layer, like, you know, big internet trucks. Check this out. It's got my private helipad on top and it's got a submarine right there. That little pink thing to the left of the HOS MPSV. Yeah, and that's how, how I looked it up. Those numbers right there. If you're interested, check it out. Yeah, so that thing can lift 10 tons. Crazy. Check out the riprap that Army Corps of Engineers laid down here to create this jetty so the sand doesn't wash away. They did a great job created this beautiful little lagoon here that everybody enjoys so much. Really, really enjoyed. Now you're gonna see this guy's playing and there's one that gets in between the other two. Check this out. Pushes them apart. That was pretty cool. Trying to keep the peace so they're fighting. I mean it's hard for me to tell so I'm hoping somebody from you know, the aquatic industry knows what's going on, right? Marine biologists specializes in porpoises would know what's going on. Yeah. One of my favorite shots with those three shadows in the back. Boom, they're running into each other, just having a blast. I mean, just having a blast. Yeah, another workhorse boat. Whoa, nice effect, love it. What do you think? You guys like that effect? Wow, that gives you a big picture of, and the beauty of this place. There they go at it again. Yeah, trying to keep them in frame was no easy task. They're quick movers. And trying to stay low enough to give you this kind of shot it's even harder. But yeah, look at these guys. They're just rolling on top of each other, bumping in each other. I'm sure they get hurt here every once in a while because I want to stop playing for a minute. But they're definitely dolphin around pretty hard. And this area is so pretty because you can, you know, surf. You can do all this underwater stuff like, you know, scuba dive and snorkel. It's just such a nice end. There's a city in the background. So you can see here. Paddle boarders are having a blast. Watch this little fish jump in between these ladies. Yeah, that's nice. There it is. Guy getting ready to get in the water. Feet, ready to jump in. And there's the view with the city in the background. Huge coastline. Tons of resorts, tons of hotels and motels, tons of condos. Pretty place. But this area is the nicest of them all, in my opinion. Because you get this. If you're a drone pilot, this is perfect. 
You got tons of targets to go after. And you get this beauty. Look at all this place. Uh, two buildings here. The main building has like uh, showers and place to eat. The left building has bathrooms. There goes that 10 ton crane on that boat. Wow. That's the money maker. Going up. Going up. Up this little bay. Matter of fact, I actually passed this boat while I was going to Costco. This is Shell Island. The only, place, the only way to get to it is by boat. You can see all the people walking down to the left being dropped off either by the boats or they anchor there and now walk it in. Like I said, the only way to get to this island is by boat. And this is one of the metal boats right here. Wow. Classic, classic drone shot. How pretty is that? There's the channel marker. For the big boat. And there's Panama City. St. Andrews Park. Definitely can chill out here. Really. And I did. 14 days here. Amazing time. Highly recommend this place. If you ever get to Florida, check it out. Really, really pretty. The facilities here are perfect. They got everything you need to clean up, eat, sunbathe, and recreational stuff that you need to do. The boat you see on the right, I was actually mapping the bottom. I actually used up two batteries filming the dolphins. The porpoises are just having a blast. I mean, just having a blast. So we come to the end of the video. If you like this video, share it with your friends. Like it, comment, and subscribe. I want to thank you for watching. Appreciate you guys taking the time to view the video. Once again, this is the Duran 5 channel. Guys, have a great day.